Talk about knowing the man in order to coach the man. So, like, average coaches know plays. Say that one more time. Average coaches, my humble opinion, you know plays. Got to play for you, coach. Got to play. Got the play suggestion. Got to play. You can draw it on a napkin. They know plays. Okay? Good coaches know a system. You know, I got this system from this guy. You know, I got this system from this place. Probably got a lot of strong belief. You need a system. You got to have a systematic approach. Okay? Good coaches know systems. Great coaches, okay, they match that system with a vision. Okay? They match that system with a vision. What do we want it to look like ultimately? What needs to be true about us for that to be true? I believe the best coaches, best leaders, they know their people and they know their players. They know their people and they know their players because they have spent time with them. Okay? They have spent time with them. Okay? Every single one of our players are at my house multiple times throughout the season. Right? Not because I think it's cute, not because I check a box, but because I know I have to spend time with these guys so I know who they are. I have to spend time with them. I'm going to make time. I got three, I got three kids under six. You guys can imagine what's going on in my house, right? We got a lot of activity, a lot of stuff going on. Bring the players, bring the coaches, okay? Everybody's in there together, and we'll be good to go, okay? But that's what we talk about, just creating that energy. <laughs> creating the energy, creating the accountability, guys. Just knowing your people, knowing your, knowing your coaches, okay? Knowing the people in your building. Before you get to those plays, before you get to the playbook, before you get to all those other things, take the time to know the people that you're, that you're, doing, that you're dealing with, guys. And then, like, average coaches, guys, they get everybody excited about a game. Get the young people excited about their life. Okay, when they get that A on the test and they've been struggling for that class, put it on the screen in front of the whole class, in front of the whole team meeting. Okay, get them excited about their life. You got to start by showing them how much you care. I do believe that, all right, without compromising and without enabling. Without compromising and without enabling, I'm going to show you how much I care, and then I can show you how competent that I am, how competent that we are as leaders, okay? But it can't go vice versa for us. That's what we really believe. So.